It can happen during combat or from something as simple as hitting your head when you fall on the ground. Either way, a traumatic brain injury or TBI can affect your long-term mental health. Doctors and medical specialists around the Pacific are using the month of March to spread awareness about TBIs. Tech Sergeant Michael Jackson reports. Tripler Army Medical Center's concussion clinic held an open house as part of Traumatic Brain Injury Awareness Month. The open house gave clinic staff a chance to share information about brain injuries with patients and health care providers. The goal is to encourage people across the Pacific to seek screening and treatment if they get injured. We're asking each of our different MTFs in the Pacific region to also do the same kind of publicity and promotion about the information that's available about TBI so that their communities, whether it be on Garrison or it's in the greater area, uh, will become more familiar with it and maybe people will start to seek help sooner rather than later or never at all. Traumatic brain injuries among military members happen during both on and off duty activities. If you look at the statistics across the military, actually 80% happen in garrison. So motor vehicle accidents, we do see a number of those. Falls, sports injuries, uh, training accidents, things like that. Service members can contact their medical providers or the Defense and Veterans Brain Injury Center at www.dvbic.org to get more information about traumatic brain injuries. Military treatment facilities like Tripler also offer several services to help people get the kind of treatment they need. Tech Sergeant Michael Jackson, Tripler Army Medical Center, Hawaii.